This morning, Fox News Channel is moving on without Bill O'Reilly. The host of the top-rated O'Reilly Factor was fired yesterday amid numerous allegations of sexual harassment that date back to 2004. The network made its first comments on O'Reilly's ouster during his former show last night. It is the end of an era here at the Fox News Channel. Fox News Everything Channel's Dana here. Perino heaped praise on Bill O'Reilly Wednesday, hours after the cable network's decision to fire him. Bill has been the undisputed king of cable news. He is an incredibly talented broadcaster who raised the bar for interviewers everywhere. Guess where Bill's going. I'll have a full report when I return. O'Reilly's ouster came as the embattled TV host vacationed in Italy, where he met with the Pope yesterday in Rome. Fire Bill O'Reilly! More than 50 major sponsors had pulled out of his show in recent weeks amid a new investigation into sexual and racial harassment against the 67-year-old. And reports Fox News and O'Reilly paid five women a total of $13 million in the past to keep quiet about his alleged sexual harassment. While O'Reilly maintains his innocence, the parent company of Fox News Channel released this statement yesterday, saying in part, quote, after a thorough and careful review of the allegations, the company and Bill O'Reilly have agreed that he will not be returning to the channel. Wendy Walsh, a former Fox commentator, says she lost a chance for a job at the Fox network after she rejected O'Reilly's advances. Fox is doing what I think Fox should do. Make a big public statement that women's rights are more important than the bottom line. In a statement, Bill O'Reilly said he was proud of his time at Fox and thanked his viewers for his success. Well, conservative host Tucker Carlson's show will now take over the O'Reilly Factor time slot.